Woke up just thinking about copping that spider. Walking right in and pull out with a title. Wanna lit like a lighter. Popping my shit, man, these niggas don't like it. Today, we got a video from Detective Jack. And it says, when entitled TikTokers think they're above the law. Let's lock into this, huh? And if you're not following the Twitch, link will be in the description below. Discord will be there as well. Seriously? What? Why you just put a bucket on my head? Someone just put a bucket on my head. Did they? Yeah. Oftentimes, TikTok- Do niggas actually fall for that shit? Damn. Hey, Chaz, this is crazy. But one thing I want to do is fuck a bitch when she's in this position right here. Awesome, like, crazy shit. Like, imagine fucking the shit out of a bitch when- for What am I talking about, dude? Fun. But some are just too extreme. They almost ended this woman's life all in the name of pranks. That's so uncalled for. I well, was the prank. disturbed to see a group of individuals laughing and filming. Pre to make things even worse, some of these TikTokers are delusional enough to think their fame on the social media can make them get away with crimes. Oh, it's just kind of bad. I don't know who I am. Nope. You can't take my phone. Hello? Hello? Hey, you want to go Let's take a look at this influence. Hey, let it be a black guy and that nigga's getting shot on sight. I'm just saying. NGTA. Let's be for real, bro. Prank you to stop? No, I'm not gonna lie. Because I, I used to want to be a little prank YouTuber. I feel like pranks can still keep going. But we got to stop. Like, I just feel like we should go back to harmless pranks. You know what I mean? ...who think their popularity can get them out of every situation. Harmless pranks are the best pranks. 2022, officers responded to multiple 911 calls about an alleged assault and bizarre driving in a Chick-fil-A parking lot in Sunrise, Florida. Of course it's Florida. At the center of it all was TikTok personality <laughs> Wyatt Yeager. Wyatt Yeager. That nigga's been watching too much goddamn uh, AOT. Let's see. Wyatt Yeager. I want to just see who... Who he is? 503k. Interesting. This nigga still locked up. Free my what the fuck people are doing worse up there. Yeah, I do know he pistoled the guy, right? <laughs> Who even is this nigga? We making the wrong niggas famous. I ain't gonna lie. Better known by his handle, Icy Wyatt. And the interesting part was, he also made a call to the police himself, accusing one of his victims of assaulting him while he was the one causing the scene. Nigga self snitch. Pointed a gun at someone. Niggas playing Among Us. His duty was parked in the middle of the road. Like right okay. at the light. Okay. To get back in the car, yeah. stop blocking traffic. You literally was that someone else's car, talk to them, banging on Wait, the Wait, is that the wide nigga right there or is that somebody else? Yeah, like, woman in the car. Like, was like, on the window. I was like, come on, man, get back in the car, go about your day. He goes, okay. Oh fuck you, this now I got a gun, all this. I'm like, okay, whatever. Oh, he cuts us off right here. Okay, right. Threw the drink. Oh no, that's not why. The I must say they wouldn't cover his face. Yeah, he, got out, he walks back into his car, he grabs his gun, points at <laughs> yeah, the mice from six nine. Oh, they pointed in my face. Yeah, yeah, I'll I'll turn go. around just to leave and right another turn around whack him in the back there. When the police finally got there, he had left. Unfortunately for him, one of the witnesses recorded what happened and showed it to the police. Oh! Uh, I saw everything. Damn! Have, uh, Got that nigga in 4K! After he, he, After he hit him? Yes. He was chasing them inside the parking lot. Like Got him in 4K, the bro. The recording showed his car, which helped the police locate him later. Officers finally find Wyatt as he was leaving his house in the notorious pink Mercedes from the video. And from what we could see, he wasn't ready to speak with the police. Hey, put the car in park. Put the car in park. Let's go. Put it in park. All right. What's listening to? Put your hands out the window. Put your hands out the window. Put both of your hands out the window, Kim. We're not fucking with you. I don't know who I am. Nope. The first thing we heard him say was, Do "See, bro, black nigga would not get away with that, bro. I'm just saying. One, I would be too scared, bro. All them good, bro." It takes one bullet, one bullet to get you gone off this earth, buddy. One bullet. I would be afraid if I saw four or five cops surrounded, surrounded me with goddamn AR-15s. I'd be scared. Am. That must be how important he feels because he- Maybe, maybe I'm just a bitch. Unfortunately, that isn't the real world. Oh, God, not that hard to cooperate with cops. I can't take the seatbelt off. Take the seatbelt off and yell the car. Do it now. Take the seatbelt off and yell the car. You sure respect this crazy, son. On the, the law. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. You're gonna get paid. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Damn. Next time you won't have that problem. Oh my god. Yeah, what is this nigga's fit? Wow. No Miranda rights. It's crazy. 
No Miranda rights. It is so hard to follow Miranda's the rules. Right to <laughs> before questioning, not before an arrest. This is not some TikTok law. The officer asked for his permission to search his car for the gun witnesses saw him with. Would you mind if we just look through it real quick? Are you allowing us to, to look through the car or no? Yes. Yes? Okay. okay. We're going to do that then. <laughs> Boom, he has a dildo on that bitch. My fault. Crazy. Just got keys or a fob. It looks like they're going to end up taking you to jail for the incident that happened with the road rage thing. Damn. They said that there was a gun involved. and they The hell, it's ain't my fault, my fault. The gun's there, and it seems like that's what happened. He said he got hit by a gun, there's a witness, the whole thing. So we can't just, we can't not, you know, unless you have something else to say about the incident. I don't hate my brother. Niggas are capping, I knew it. And they described the gun and everything, and there was somebody else so that was watching. my girlfriend can't be a witness to us. Was she with you? Yes. Girlfriend? That ain't sound too zesty to have a girlfriend, I don't know why you. Don't respond to any text messages. Babe, I'm getting arrested because of those people that cut me off. I pulled that, I pulled the gun out to show them through the window, like, don't with me, and they all went back in their car. Bro, some, some, some niggas get a gun and think, like, they still can't get touched, bro. You know what I'm saying? I can't go to jail tonight. I have to work, like. You are in absolutely no fault. I'm telling you. Go right. Go right. Hey, it's crazy. That nigga's still locked up to this day, bro. I gotta call my mom. Goodbye. You can't take my phone. He claimed the police couldn't take his phone, but actually, they legally can. You can't take my phone. This is my possession, so now you're gonna be a thief. Now you're gonna be a thief. You're under arrest. You're not allowed to have a phone, okay? Wow. Man, yes. girl. <laughs> oh my God, girl, I'm getting arrested right now. I love you, babe. Go down the window. No, you don't have any right to hear what we're talking about. You're talking about me, though. Man, I get fucked by that shit, bro. I, I don't think I'm being full at all. You are being. Okay, I'm sorry that you think that. I'm not gonna be no cop, bro. See, I'm gonna be in no position of power, bro. Cause that nigga do that shit, bro. I'm whacking him with my fucking gun. Shit, his freaky ass might like that shit. Never mind. You don't see the problem by somebody with a bright pink car. Who girl, like why are they arresting me? Like back me up, girly. On the, on the freeways all the time, and that's why I carry a gun. What kind of logic is that, bro? Just because you're famous online doesn't mean that you can't have a gun. Like. Motherfucker, I, motherfucker, I can have a gun. And I'm not famous, and I still get fucked with. You know what I'm saying? Like it just, it, 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 that's not how life works, buddy. That is it. That is you said legal. You literally, you nigga, bro, nigga, literally has evidence of him getting fucking or, uh, of him smacking someone in the face with a gun, bro. It is legal in Florida to have a gun. Right. Car. W's in the shit. Where can you prove? Show me the video proof. Y'all yeah, need the follow, man. Him with a gun. We don't need video proof. Yes, you that. do. Because I have several witnesses that will testify against. Okay. It's then, giving then you can't take my phone. <laughs> Nail you polish. You have no proof. Okay. You don't even know what gun is the same gun that I hit with if I did. Mm, nope. So nigga just self snitched on himself. You don't even know Got his ass. Was used in bro, nigga love saying, bro. You don't even know what I did if I did it, though. OJ did that shit. Nigga OJ wrote a whole book on what he would have done if he if he didn't do it. Like what the fuck? You or if he did do it. I would like them to come talk okay. to you guys. No, we can't call your mom. Where are the keys in the inside the vehicle? How'd you find no. the stream? How bad can I be? We're gonna stow it. Tell it. Oh, easy. Whoa, buddy. Step step inside. Okay. Tell it. That's enough. Calm down, Wyatt. Wyatt, who was initially calm, became violent after his phone was taken from him. It. Typical TikToker. He was taken to the police station, but that wasn't all. He Damn, that nigga caused more, more commotion? He's coming out, Wyatt. Hey, Wyatt, so a couple things can happen right now. Um, just listen to him. What we want to do, we're going to swap the handcuffs and put her handcuffs on you, but also all your expensive jewelry and stuff. Because we want to make sure that nothing bad happens to your stuff. Once it goes down to jail, that's somebody else handling it. We'll put it in safekeeping here. It's going into an evidence locker until you come back to pick it up. Okay. Why do I have to go to jail? 
Nigga, Fuck you pissed off somebody, nigga! You pissed off the guy over the head with a gun. No, I didn't. You have That's that. aggravated assault! Yo, nigga. Bro, did this nigga actually chase this nigga? Run. Oh, I thought they, I thought they was gonna show it, bro. We just talking down. You have no the guy witness. is here giving a statement right now, Wyatt. Okay, let me see his video. You don't have to. God, Wyatt. We don't have to. I have family that work in police force. Okay. You guys are talking to the wrong person. Wyatt. Nigga, they don't give a fuck. It's 2022. We have body cameras. People have cell phones. It doesn't matter. You didn't there. body camera me pistol whipping somebody with a gun. He did it. Right. What's happening? Take off your deal, listen, you have two options. Why don't you take and your rings off yourself? The, the jail's okay? probably not going to take your rings <laughs> Unintentionally, too? Goofy had a little car yeah, pistol working so with a gun. Here. No, I need we're label bags and everything. We're going to put it on a thing, and we're going to have you sign it. Well, we have to... Why, 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 why are you gone? You're not allowed to walk Let me see you do it first, then. What? You're not about to take $30,000, $40,000 worth of jewelry without me knowing exactly where it's going. And I'm going to write it on this form, and then you're going to So go ahead and write it on the form. Yo, who the fuck do you think he is, bro? You don't know what this jewelry is valued. Wyatt, come on now. I don't. You pissed to me the whole entire I've time in the car. So nice to you. No, uh, you've, you've been, been the calling the every car. Car. Back in the car. I hate niggas like this, bro. I hate niggas like this, bro. Just fucking listen, dude. It's never that hard. Cause now you're making life harder for everybody else around you, bro. Okay. Stay in LA, buddy. Stay in LA, buddy. That's not what he said. You think you're a, I think you, you, I, I think you're you a have big issues with your ears. That's you not what he even said. That's not what he even said. You guys are so. Annoying. It's like yeah. a power trip. Yeah, that nigga voice is so fucking yeah. annoying. Holy shit. You guys don't do that. You guys had no friends in school. That's true. None. You guys had no anybody thinking that you were cool. So Tiger like, King, you move your arm again. Uh, <laughs> I can't move. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Like, who the fuck do you think he is, bro? Uh, go buy a car. Stop. Yeah, How does nigga even fine. get, get famous? Like, what the fuck? Let them swap the car. I'm not resisting. Okay. You know this is an eighty thousand dollar chain on my neck you're pressing, right? No one gives a right. fuck, right. nigga. I tried right to now. take it and put it right. in evidence. Right. 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 Alright, have a seat. In the His freaky ass probably wouldn't be handed on God. No wonder why a nigga fighting so goddamn much. Hey, there you go. Another charge right there. He said, nigga, like me if I was a cop, bro. <laughs> Shit, give me that nigga jewelry. I'm selling that motherfucker. Hey, who want an eighty thousand dollar chain, my nigga? Hey, got that motherfucker on me. Used some offensive words on the police officer and even kicked the door. He was later charged with two counts of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon without intent to kill. One count of aggravated battery with a deadly weapon. Hey, let let a black guy get this. He's getting fucking damn near life in prison. Let's see how long he got. One count of battery on an officer and one count of resisting arrest. How many years you get? Hopefully, his TikTok followers will save him now. But he wasn't the only one who thought. Oh damn! They didn't. They didn't give a uh, date. On August twenty fourth, he just looked like a bad bitch. <laughs> law enforcement responded to a distressing oh my report God. in the neighborhood. I told me who's next. Discovered wandering alone in the residential area. Adding to the astonishment, the culprit responsible for the incident is a well-known TikTok personality. As officers arrive, they are faced with limited information, unaware of the unfolding situation. Oh, they said they were inside there. Faced with limited information, but they found out that, this, that she's a TikTok personality. I'm out with them. Shit, all you gotta do is look up a motherfucking name, the whole background search. The boy told his name while they waited for backup. One time I asked where he lives, he pointed to me. Uh, you pointed there? Just once. Okay. I have other officers coming, so um, if you could just hang on to him for yeah, a minute. Just wait by my car, obviously, yeah. because we're going to clear the house to make sure. There might be someone at home. Right. The police found the house the boy came out from, but there was nobody inside. However, the neighbors described the residents of the building. Turns who are they? The little boy's mom is a TikTok star named Marissa. And they just moved to the neighborhood. Marissa, you know I gotta do a background search. Marissa, TikTok star arrest. Damn, niggas looking this shit up too. This is not the Marissa that <laughs> is showing. Damn, bro, couldn't find her. They got her number from one of the neighbors and contacted her. However, Marissa's mom arrived at the scene before her, and she was visibly disturbed by the whole situation. Hello, mom. Hi, um, I'm Sergeant Moreau. You can come. Everything is okay. I'm going to explain to you what's going on. I talked to her. Um, so earlier this evening, we get a phone call. There's a small child in the community unattended. Uh, we come out here. We're with the little boy, which is your grandpa. 
Uh, apparently, mom had stepped away to go and get with friends or meet with friends and left him unattended. And that nigga started, what the this fuck? Asked, um, and he was there. walking around by himself? Yes, ma'am. We just moved here. Literally. Bro, like, I know some kids, like, just be doing shit. But, bro, when I was a little jit, I wasn't just out here roaming the streets by myself. <laughs> like, what the fuck? The beginning of August. Okay. Just bought the house. Okay. Okay, hold on. So he's inside. You Yo, but L parenting, though. And that's why I had called you out here. Do you have your idea? L fucking parenting. Okay. So that's why we called you out here because we're Why does he look so surprised? Probably because her fucking grandson is attend is is walking in the street fucking unattended, bro. Like, she'll be going to jail today. So I just, yeah, yeah. They're leaving a child unattended. It's a very serious offense. Oh, I get it. I didn't, know was an, I didn't even know that was an offense. So, um, what did he do? He was just walking, roaming the streets at night by himself. Um, stand by with this officer. Uh, will you be able to take your bread? Nigga, so nobody... Wait. So the neighbors had the bitch phone? So clearly, motherfuckers knew who they were. And no one just decided, like, hey, let's bring the kid back to where the fuck he lives. She had provided me with a number for you, mm -hmm. with her cousin, and with uh, an, an aunt, I believe, that lives my here? My aunt. It's my sister. Your she sister? Yeah. Okay. Um, is this something that you ladies can do? Because if not, I, I would have to call the Department of uh, Children no, and Family. Uh, no, please come with me. Okay. I, I called you here. That's yeah, why, you know. Thank you. Okay, just stand by for a minute. Yeah. Hang tight with our okay. Officer Bradford. I'm shocked that she did that. I can't believe it. Where's her name? I don't know where the nanny is. Does she usually have a nanny? She has a nanny. Yeah. A Yo, she probably murked the nanny, bro. She made that decision. That's that's so hard. Right. They have a child lock or something to keep them in. That nigga probably unlocked the door. That nigga, bro, the little kid probably getting abused and went out. She finally composed Be for herself real. and was about to take the child inside when Marissa arrived. She obviously wasn't proud of what she. That little nigga was outside slinging. He knows what he was doing. Wow. What's he doing? Oh, what happened? I, I missed this part. Inside. She finally composed herself and was about to take the child inside when Marissa arrived. She obviously wasn't proud of what she had done. Okay. So Marissa wasn't proud of what she did, but she did it anyway. Yes, ma'am. Explain us something, Marissa. How the fuck you get here? Is he like sleeping? Yeah, he, he, he a little shit. Yes. He said, uh, he's talking to her mom. Yes, yes, yes. Are we good to go on the other end? Uh, what did he say? Huh? Wait, dude, the, the little kid was just, uh, unattended. He was roaming the streets. But she was like the, the legal guardian. Well, I guess that is the mom. I like the title. Let's go, Tara. Thank you. Need you react to uh, scary bits like you did a little Something minute ago? That I, Shit, that would be fun. She looks clearly ashamed of her actions. But the consequences of her actions scared her more as she asked the crucial question, am I being arrested? And yes, she will. However, Damn. she was allowed to meet her job. Bro, that's so crazy, bro. That's so crazy, like... You can get arrested for something so small like that, bro. That's actually fucking crazy. ...before she left, probably to express how sorry she was. I was just asking if I was getting arrested, ma'am. No? Oh, we don't know yet. Okay, ma'am. No. Sorry. <laughs> nah, she's shivering in her boots. Mom or something. I was like, I've been out here so his mom left her son <laughs> to go film one of them TikToks. Hey, hey, I'm sorry I made a mistake. Yeah, that bitch really getting arrested now. I wonder if she uses her TikTok fame to get out of the situation. To cuff you in front of where your son might see you. I'm not going to do that. Put your hands together like you're crying. Palm to palm. Palm to palm. Damn, she really getting packed up. That's crazy. Is your car open? Oh, which one? The token on it? Yes. Is it okay if not? Hey, yo, uh, Lewis, Lewis, ain't nothing like a, ain't nothing like a ankles party. What you mean by that? What you mean by that? What's good, Lewis? I feel all well. Welcome to the stream, man. And what's good, Cindy? 
What's up, man? Fontaine, no see you, man. Is it okay if an officer goes in there to get it? Uh, can my mom get it? How am I great? She left her son alone to running out of laundry. Astonished. But the lack of a receipt for a nearby store visit and a Man, partially that filled bitch. detergent container raised doubts. Her attire, described as unsuitable for a late night store run, further cast doubt on her story. Nigga, be what? Partially filled detergent container raised doubts. Lack of receipt. Okay. Her attire, described as unsuitable. Nigga, what the fuck? How is this unsuitable for a, for a late, late night, night store run? Bitch isn't. Nigga, she got pants on in the shirt. What the fuck? Further cast out on her story. After being read her Miranda rights, Marissa confessed to not visiting the store, but meeting a friend miles away after Ooh. putting her son to bed. Despite an initial child neglect charge and a brief jail stay, charges were dropped by Lee County about. Hey, the but hold on though. Damn, Marissa. She my fault. But dude, she put her kid to bed. So that means the kid took it upon himself to leave. So is it really her fault? I'm just saying. If my kid want to run away, clearly I'm doing something wrong. Weeks later, W's with unclear reasons for the decision. But I'm good, Cindy. What you been on, man? 2022. You ain't seen the, the, the yacht? Did she have a yacht? I didn't really see the that shit. The officer followed the car and pulled the driver said, over for a traffic they stop. They said, fuck it, we ball. Turns out the driver was Chloe DeFada. A Why the fuck did this bitch look familiar? Yo, this bitch got arrested? Yo, this bitch got arrested? God damn. God damn. God damn, bitch got the same fucking pose. God damn. Bitch got a default emo. My fault. I handcuff her too. Popular TikTok what she do? star. It didn't take long for the officer to know there was something wrong with her. Well, hold on. I gotta see, see the tattoo. She got a tattoo right there in her. For the officer. Oh, it's her. I never want to be a tattoo muff. Never mind. Never. Mind. To know there was something uh -huh. wrong with her. My fault. <laughs> Free you, my heart. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, Chloe kind of bad. Hey, how you doing? I'm okay. in Tampa Police Department. Is everything okay? Yes, sir. You, you know why I'm stopping you? Okay. You're kind of all over the road back there. You're turning real wide. Oh, she drunk. Past the stop bar. Is there anything going on? Oh, she just got back from a ditty party. Um, I live at the Heron up here. I'm just going home. Okay. Are you, do you have any kind of medical issues or anything like that? No, sir. Where are you coming from? Um. Hey, bro, see, this is why I couldn't, I couldn't be no cop, bro. <laughs> I couldn't be no cop. Because, hey, shorty, let me take you in the back of my cop car real quick, and we can drop all these charges. Yeah, yeah I was picking up some evil. Okay. Do you have your license with you? I do not. I have my registration. I don't have my license on me. Okay. Do you I have a it. license? I do, yes. Okay. I just don't have it on me. I apologize. Okay. Yeah. Do you have your registration then? No, I, I like her voice. I ain't gonna lie. That, that nice little raspiness. Ooh. Okay. Gets me going. My fault. Yeah, you got it. Yes, sir. Here you are. So, you're not living on Nuremberg anymore? No. That's my mother. Okay. I moved up to the Heron up here recently. God, I've never moved. So you have nothing with your information on it? Not on me right now, no. At my apartment, I do. Okay. All right. What's your name? Chloe. Spell it. C-H-L-O-E. Who's a passenger bridge? There's someone in the passenger I ain't even beat. Same as uh, your mom's? Yes, Marissa. What's your date of birth? 10-12-03. Do you have a middle initial? S. Suzanne. Suzanne. Just hang tight for me. Wouldn't let that slide with a the number. Officer collected her information and looked her up. He came oh, so there is somebody in the passenger. The officer collected her. Oh, that's a nigga. And looked oh, that's a nigga. See, this is why you can't be fucking with the white bitches. They get you in situations like this, bro. If he was fucking with a black queen, he wouldn't have been. He wouldn't have been an accomplice. Her up. He came back and asked her to step out of the vehicle. She let that nigga hit on me. She did. She kind of sound like a Kira, uh, but more raspy voice. Oh God! Damn, that nigga recorded her getting packed up. That's crazy. Damn, so how the fuck that nigga finna get home? What the fuck? She left my nigga stranded. Step back this way for me. 
Wait, they, can they can they do anything if you're the passenger and you ain't know? Can they do anything? He finna get that car and dip. But what if that nigga doesn't have anything on him? Nah, I would have been laughing. <laughs> hey, motherfucker, I would. I would. I put that bitch on my spam, nigga. So, where exactly were you coming from? Uh, over in Ebor. Anywhere in particular? Or? I was just picking. Yeah, she got a bun so, chin. Okay, so you you were just picking him up? Yes. Mean ass butt chin, bro. It's still unless you got a goddamn bullet hole through that bitch. My fault. No sir. Okay. Okay. Do you have any medical issues with you? Do you take any kind of medication? Oh, she better no, she better cry like shit. Kind of drink no. Not a drop. Not a drop. Would you mind if I check your eyes as part of field sobriety to make sure that you're okay to be driving? Uh, for a while. Up until this moment, she for was a while. The police answering his questions promptly. The police could perceive alcohol from her breath, but she denied taking it. Okay, anything. okay. She wouldn't agree to taking a sobriety test either. That's... See, like... If y'all... Why do motherfuckers do this shit? Like, just fucking comply. You're already fucking caught. You might as well just... You might as well just tell the truth, nigga. Definitely suspicious. You might as well just tell the truth. Because I can smell some alcohol coming from your breath. Okay? Like, I have like not. I said, you're telling me that, that you... you just and then she don't even want to take the test, bro. Now, now you're lying, bro. All right, I went out to dinner before I picked him up. Sure. Yes, sir. Sure. So the, right now, I'm I'm concerned about your level of sobriety based off your driving pattern and my contact with you. And I will tell you as much with as with you. I am perfectly fine. Thank okay. you so much. And that, that's why I would like to check your eyes to kind of ensure that I'm, you're okay. I'm all right. Thank you. Okay. Here, here, here <laughs> and now we're going in circles, bro. I've been following you for a good little bit since you were at Nebraska in seven. Damn, little freak, yes. Hey, I know you're doing your job though, but I know you saw her. And was like, damn, huh. it's kind of bad. I, so you went down you're not slick, unk. You were above the speed limit. You went well over into the bike lane. You went back over to the other lane. You stopped past the stop bar onto. Hey, but chat, don't drink and drive though. You made a wide turn onto. You, or you gonna end up like this bitch? Made a wide turn onto here. Uh, in my contact with you, like I said, I'm smelling some alcohol from your breath. Uh, I'd like. I have not drank any alcohol tonight. Sir. <laughs> but I, I would like yeah, W-cap. To kind of ensure that you're okay to be I driving. I can tell you right now that I'm good to be driving my car. Sure. And I live right down the street right, right. here at in, the Heron. Sure. And in, in my in interaction with you, I'm seeing some indications of impairment. So I'd like you to do. I'd like to at least check your eyes to ensure that you're okay to be driving. You don't have to do it. To Yo, what? Like, like, what is? What do you think that nigga in the car is thinking right now, bro? Like, 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 what do you, what do you think that like he's thinking? Nigga, like me would have been like, damn, you're a dumb bitch. <laughs> like, what happens if you don't? What happens is it puts me in a position where I have to make a decision to arrest you or not based on the evidence that I've seen this far. Wow. Yeah, so that's that's why I'm trying to give you the opportunity to kind of Gosh. you know prove some of my or dissuade some of my suspicions. Sir, suspicion. I will tell you right now that I am good to be driving. Back Yo, Louis, on Gashi, on Gashi, blinking hard as shit. She manually blinking right Sir. now. I have not been drinking. I am good to go. Okay. So, I don't know what else to tell you, sir. Okay. So, so, would you mind if I checked your eyes? As no. As you may, you may check my eyes. Okay. If you would like to check my eyes. Tell you what, About damn time. Fuck. Yes, do you wear glasses or contacts? I do. I have glasses. You don't have them on right now? Do you have I contacts in right now? No, I do not. Okay. I so lost my glasses. Put your feet together for me. Damn, so damn bitch, so you wear glasses too? You can't see shit on that motherfucking road. And you're drunk? Holy shit. She finally agreed to have her eyes checked after the police said she could be arrested. Y'all niggas ever saw a 3D movie without y'all without the glasses on and the movie looks like weird as shit? That's how her vision's looking right now. She refused. Miss drunk and the fucking first blind. Test wasn't that convincing. The police asked for a further test, which she denied. Wait for what happened next. What happened? Oh, she can look at me like that. My fault. Yes, I'm seeing some things in your eyes that's gonna be a little concerned as far as your level of sobriety. If I should do a couple other field sobriety exercises, would you be willing to do them for me? Walk on that line, bitch. I feel like I've done enough. I, I need to go home. I gotta go to bed. I wanna go make sure my cat's good and go to my mother's tomorrow morning. Okay. Yes, well, I, again, let me let me just kind of uh, again advise you what what where we're at in the kind of proceedings here. Yes, um, I'd like you to do the field sobriety exercises. I can't Damn, do. bro, you holding up my nigga in the car. Bro, I, the whole time I'm just thinking about the nigga in the car. You holding that nigga up, bro. My nigga's trying to go to sleep, bro. My nigga probably got a sneaky it's link plan right now. Oh, that's why, that's why I love being I DD, bro. Sir, you are terrifying the shit out of me, if I'm going to okay. be honest with you. Well, I mean, I'm not trying to be. I'm trying to you know, I wanna, be courteous to you. I want to go home. Sure. I want to go to sleep. Sure. I want to go to my mother's tomorrow. She has a vision of a spider right now? Oh, God. This is taking up time. I want to go to 
I want to go to bed. I've had my, like, I've had enough. Imagine yeah. telling the cop that, hey, bro, you, you, you're doing your job too well right now, bro. I want to go home. <laughs> Sir, all right, all right. Sir, 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 yo, sir, 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 yo, stop, stop, listen, yo, and the nigga in the car is just thinking, damn, this bitch really getting arrested right now. Hey, nigga, like me would have been in the back, like. Like, check y'all seeing this? <laughs> oh, he was! Stop. Okay. Damn, nigga, gotta drive your whip back to the crib and he can't even get home himself. You stop doing that to me, please. please. Okay, I will do your whatever test. I will do your test, sir. Sir, okay, I will do your test, please. Uh, that, that, the horse has already left the barn for that. Okay, right now you're being arrested for DUI. Yo, what the fuck kind of weak ass, hero, heroic ass speech was that, nigga? Please. That, that, the horses already left the barn tonight. The horses have left the barn tonight. Nah, that nigga's cursed. Okay, right that, that nigga white as shit, bro. Country yeah, bunking ass nigga, bro. Information not about college, your system. The sir, horses have left the know, barn tonight. We got him. Namely, your license will be suspended for a period of six months. For a period of sorry. Sir, can I just do? Can years. I just do whatever you need me to do? I've already asked. And this is why I couldn't be a cop. That right there is why I could not be a cop. Cause um <laughs> What do you mean by that? I've skipped this uh I've skipped this scene multiple times. Would you take up that offer in a heartbeat? Or would I I, I would take that up. Nigga, I'm asking her to piss in my Yo, the video is almost done, chat. <laughs> she agreed to take the test after she was arrested, but it was too late. Jit from Texas BTW. You should hear that saying left and right. Bro, no, I'm not hearing that shit left and right. She was taken to the police station and charged with DUI. Turns out that wasn't the first time she'd been caught for DUI. Damn! Earlier, but she hasn't learned her lessons yet. She was put in custody for 12 days without bail. It's high. Hey, shit. Tampa, flop. Why is it always Florida, motherfuckers? Hey, for you, shorty. Yo, W fucking video, bro. W video. Hey, man. The horses have left the barn this time, bro.